I want to do a quick video about thankfulness. I'm reading in the scriptures, and well, let me tell, let me paint a picture for you. Jesus is on his way back to Jerusalem. He's passing through a village. There were ten leper men that were destined to die. There's no hope. When you're a leper at that time, you were going to die. They stood afar off, away from him, and just cried out and said, Jesus, have mercy. Obviously, they'd heard that Jesus had done healing. And, and Jesus said, go show yourself to the priest. And as they were going, they were healed. The leprosy was gone. Nine of them keep going, but one of them returns. Let's read it. And it came to pass as they went to Jerusalem that he passed through a midst of Samaria of Galilee. And as he entered into a certain village there, met him ten men that were lepers, which stood afar off. They lifted up their voices and said, Jesus, Master, have mercy on us. And when he saw them, he said unto them, Go show yourself to the priest. And it came to pass that as they went, they were cleansed. And one of them, when he saw that he was healed, turned back and with a loud voice glorified God and fell down on his face at his feet, giving him thanks. And he was a Samaritan. And Jesus answered, Were there not ten cleansed? But where are the nine? Yeah. There are not found that return to glorify, to give glory to God, save this stranger. And he said unto him, Arise and go thy way. Thy faith has made thee whole. So something happened. What, the one man was a Samaritan. He wasn't a Jew. But something touched his heart. What was it? Well, thankfulness. The others just went to show the priest. They, God healed them outwardly. But the one Samaritan man, something happened to him outwardly and inwardly in that he took the time to stop and realize what had just happened. So the nine went and showed the priest, obviously, but they were only fixed on the outside. The Samaritan, he who was completely absolutely thankful and he was healed on the inside so that is my question today when Jesus has done so much for us he died on a cross he did all these things are we still thankful if he cleanses us from something on the outside did he do are you noticing what he did on the inside yeah I mean it you can God can heal your body and and he can give you if you had a crippled hand, he could get he could heal your hand. But the, would that heal the inside? See, that's the question. Is we need to search for the inward healing and you don't have necessarily have to be healed on the outside. It's the heart that makes the difference. To be healed in your spirit, to be born again, to know that God lives and He loves you and that He healed the inside. I have arthritis and some days are very bad for me. And I would like for God to heal that, of course. But what I'm thankful for is what God did on the inside of me and that He gave me hope and love. And He may not heal me from arthritis. That's, that's, that's up to Him. And that's all right if he doesn't, because what's the inside's been cleansed and washed. I gave my heart to Jesus, and he forgave me of my sin. Then when I stumble and make a mistake, he forgives me and helps me learn from it and go and not do it anymore. That's the healing that we need. That's what we need to be searching for. So ten leper men, one turned and gave him thanks. And he truly went home healed, inside and out. That's my video. Remember what Jesus did for you and how he loves you. And don't be unthankful or ungrateful. Always remember, mark these things in your mind when God did something good for you. That way that you can always be thankful. And there can be a cleansing and a washing and a changing and a blessing on the inside. That's my video today. I'm just so pumped up while I'm talking about this. That's my video. I love you with all my heart. 
and stop back often share like and subscribe share this video and i'll be back to do more videos very soon and i love you remember search for the healing on the inside yeah that's what's important we'll talk to you soon love you bye